like my favorite part of moving. We go to Raccoon every morning. Welcome back to the vlogs. If you're new, my name is Allison. Currently just moved from Boston to Miami, so I'm in my new Miami apartment. We went so hard last night. I stayed up till like midnight just unboxing everything and like we got the foundation of the layout, but obviously stuff needs to be decorated and cleaned and we need to get a ton of stuff. We brought most of our furniture from Boston and I'm so happy we did. I feel like we really don't need to get much. We need bar stools, a TV stand, and I think that's pretty much it. Oh, and we need a desk for the office, and like, I think that's all the furniture we really need to buy. I have an entire list on my phone. Yeah, this is the list of everything that we need. So we're going to Target right now. I have a whole empty apartment tour linked. We're just gonna explore the downtown area where we live because I don't even know what's around here. And we don't have cars. We sold both of our cars. So we do still have the U-Haul, but I think we're just gonna walk because everything's like in walking distance. I'll show you guys a haul when I get back with what we got. All right, back from Target and I put everything out on the couch, so I'll do a quick little haul for you guys. This cute wooden like dish scrubber, really like this, matches the aesthetic of the apartment. I'm trying out these scrub mommy, like scrub daddy sponges. I've actually never tried them, but they look really good and heavy duty and I like the white, so got these. Shower foaming cleaner, because all my showers are like white tiles, so I really wanted to make sure I'm like on top of cleaning them already. I got Myers products, they're my favorite. I wanted to get the lemon scent, so I got two of the multi-purpose sprays. Dish soap for the sink in the kitchen. We don't have any candles yet, so I wanted the apartment to smell good, so I just got two of these plugins. I normally never use these, but I got the Hawaiian Aloha scent to make it smell beachy in here. We don't have any pens, and I need to like do work stuff, so I just bought some paper mate pens, aluminum foil, some dryer sheets. I have this same exact trash can in the master bathroom, so I wanted to get one for the guest bathroom that's the same. I got this basket to put Otto's toys in. I really liked it. I thought it was really cute and he needs something because right now they're just in like a regular moving box. I decided I'm gonna throw out all of my white towels and go for beige towels because the white just gets so dirty looking and dingy. So I got like the Threshold brand. I just got three to start out of like the bath towels. Got a couple face cloths and then like hand towels as well. I really like the color. We need a shower curtain for the guest bathroom. So I really liked this like thick woven one from Threshold again. It's like an off-white color. And then I got a plastic curtain to go with it and then just like the little rods, or not the rods, the little rings to go with it. Toilet paper, paper towels. These toilet wands are my absolute favorite way to clean a bathroom toilet. I think they're so easy, quick to use, and they do a good job. They're Clorox brand. So I already had one of these for the master bathroom, but I bought one for the guest bathroom. And then we didn't have a plunger. I thought this one was pretty like cute and aesthetic. It looks like a little plant pot. I like it. Then we didn't have a broom, so I tried to just get like a plain, a plain colored broom. And then this is again to clean the tile shower. Dog pads for Otto because he's been really anxious and like having accidents so that's just in case so he doesn't pee all over the floor when we start leaving him. And all of this was around $400 and I feel like that was a big chunk of what we needed so I feel really good about that. Also got some trash bags because we had none and some Swiffer wet jet refills because I already have the Swiffer and it's so clutch for cleaning these types of floors. Like I literally just take the Swiffer out and start cleaning whenever I want, it's so nice. Yeah, all of our trash is here so we didn't have trash bags. So I'm gonna put all of this away and then I'll pick up the vlog a little later when we're doing something. Still have to go grocery shopping so I'm sure I will do like a first grocery haul too in the apartment. That's so exciting. This is like my favorite part of moving. I love just restocking on everything you need and getting everything nice and fresh and new. I just showered for the first time in the apartment. Um, whole lot of firsts happening today since this is our first real day living here. 
So actually, this couch is from Modani Furniture, like our clog couch that we've had forever. And we noticed that there was a Modani literally like right downstairs from our apartment and I've never seen a Modani in person. I don't even really know what like their other furniture is like. I only know about this couch and we're in need of a desk. So we're just gonna go check it out and see if we find any furniture there that we like. We kind of like this desk, like acrylic gray wood. We really like this TV stand because it's really low and white. It has like the glass. The only thing is it's not a lot of storage, but like it's really cute. We might get it. It's 650. Want a really cool planter for the balcony. This is the kind of chair I want for the balcony, but this one's 15.99. Just drove to dinner. back from furniture shopping with our friends from college who live down here which is so exciting that we like already have friends down here like definitely so nice and they've been down here for like over a month so they know a bunch of good spots already they live right near us so it's so convenient we went like 20 minutes away to go to some like thrift stores vintage stores to look at furniture did not find anything and then we went to Wynwood and like went out to eat and just walked around that area which was really cool it's Sunday and me and Ryan, Ryan has work tomorrow on Monday and he really needs to get a desk. We like, we really need to get the office room like into shape so that he can like physically work from there. So we have to go get an office desk. I think we're gonna go to this place called City Furniture, probably Home Goods, like look around, but we only have the U-Haul for another couple days. So we wanna make sure like we get something now so that we can drive it back to our apartment because we don't have cars. Hopefully we can find some furniture today. Thinking this nightstand is definitely the one, like it matches our kitchen wood exactly. And also this desk we think is perfect. They also have a nice cloud couch loop here. And look at this table, I'm obsessed with this and the chairs, so cute. So the desk didn't ship till October and then to get free delivery we would have to pay like over a thousand dollars and if not we we're gonna have to pay like two hundred dollars for delivery so it just wasn't worth it so now we're going to home goods so hopefully home goods has something but i'm sad because that tv stand was like perfect for our apartment so we went to home goods west elm and Staples because Brian was <laughs> insisting on getting a desk from Staples and I was so against it but honestly we picked one out and it's not that bad I'll show it to you when we put it together hopefully it's not that bad but he needed the desk like immediately and yeah we might go to back to West Elm to get like a TV stand or something but yeah I also got some things at home goods that I'll show you guys when we get home all right I got these two laundry bins from home goods i like them because of the gray finish that matches like the grayish wood and i just like these canvas style looking bags so i think these are cute i don't know where i'm gonna put them yet i like the size of them i think they're nice and big and obviously you can take this out and wash it which i really like i got new salt and pepper shakers I brought these from my old apartment. They're from Target, but they honestly get residue everywhere and I'm just like over them. I think these are cute. So I'm gonna throw these out. Got one of these at clear egg cases. I'm obsessed with these and I never had one at my old apartment. I just think they make the fridge look so aesthetic. We still don't have groceries right here.
first grocery haul in the new apartment i just got the amazon whole foods delivered they delivered it right to my apartment complex door i didn't even have to go downstairs which is so amazing i just wanted to do something quick and easy instead of having to go out and get groceries for the first time so i'll show you guys a little haul i got the whole foods brand 100 percent cold pressed juice i feel like i have not eaten a vegetable in so long just with traveling like we've been getting a lot of fast food and ordering out so wanted to get things for like a little reset for my stomach. Definitely wanna get some more greens in, so I got some green juices along with the immunity boost shots. I got the ginger and turmeric. I got the milk almond unsweetened milk. Love this milk. I got some little ice cream sandwiches for desserts. For vegetables, I got some like mini carrots, cucumbers, and tomatoes, cause I'm gonna make a little salad with this. For some dinners, I got some salmon fillets with some vegetable fried rice. And then for fruits, I got blueberries, some peaches, avocados for avocado toast, bananas, lemons. I got this black bean salad for lunches because I think it looks really good. I really wanted to try it. I got the sourdough Whole Foods brand bread, which I've never tried, so I'm really excited. I love sourdough. Had to stock up on some olive oil because we don't have any. I got some ranch for the carrots and just in general, just some cheese for eggs. Got some eggs some mozzarella that I'm gonna add and cut up in a salad. I got some Greek yogurt for yogurt bowls in the morning with fruit. And then I just got some granola for the yogurt bowls or I could also eat it like with cereal with the almond milk. I'm obsessed with these cauliflower cheddar crackers for a snack. I got an Annie's in case I'm having like a lazy dinner night and then didn't have butter. This is my favorite butter, the pure Irish butter. Good mini grocery haul for like starting out. Some other stuff that I got, I got one of these things for like the glass shower in the master bathroom. I think these are fun to use to like clean the shower. We don't have a good like knife set yet, so I just got a couple knives so that I can start cooking in the apartment. We didn't have any kitchen towels. I'm going for like a very beige neutral theme, so I thought these were cute from the Threshold brand from Target. Got some new Quip heads. Me and Ryan both have a Quip toothbrush. I love these toothbrushes. Haven't changed my head in a while though. And then I got this command hook for a towel in the bathroom because there's nowhere to really like hang a hand towel. And the accents in our bathroom are silver so I thought it matched. It looks really sleek and then boring but I had to get some razors. And then I got this little bathroom stand to go in the master bathroom that doesn't have a tub and there's only one little marble shelf so i felt like we needed somewhere else to put our bath products so i thought this might be good some other things we got from target we actually ordered these bar stools online but when we were in target today we saw them in the exact color and they had two of them so we decided and we still have the u-haul for today so we decided we would just pick them up and cancel our online order because it was going to take like two or three weeks to come in so these are stunning they are the exact beachy wicker look that i'm going for in the apartment and they weren't that expensive i think they were like 200 dollars. i love their furniture pieces so ryan's going to build these after his work call and then we even got a bookshelf for the office space from Target, just like a plain white one that Ryan's also gonna build, so I'll show you that. We have to take it in from the U-Haul, it's super heavy, but yeah, I feel like a major the majority of my furniture is from Target, and like it's just an affordable way to furnish an apartment quickly. Not that I'm really trying to rush to furnish it, but like I really am not trying to spend an arm and a leg at freaking West Elm or CB2 on all the beautiful furniture. I feel like Target has really good like look-alikes and still that same kind of vibe that I'm going for. So definitely check out Target. Working 
working on the bookshelf. <laughs> it sucks. But it's just a plain white bookshelf like this. Here is the bookshelf. Pretty plain but simple and cute. Really like it. Now the best part, decorating it. Ryan just finished the stools. They look so good. I'm glad we only got two of them. The two looks really, really good. I love the apartments coming together. It's so exciting. I love them. I couldn't imagine like any other stool in this apartment. I always walk out on my balcony and do my five minute journal in the morning. Been really into making yogurt bowls. I use this Cascadian Farm granola. Just have blueberries, bananas, and Chobani yogurt. And then we go to Raccoon every morning, which is like a little pop-up truck. Nice, healthy, like breakfast and like drinks, coffee, matchas, iced chais, all of that. So that's been the routine. I just got back from Starbucks. I've been going to Starbucks in the morning to work because I still don't have Wi-Fi at the apartment, so still trying to get my videos uploaded, but I made some brand selects. That always takes me like a couple hours, and yeah, I was making thumbnails and just doing some admin work. I also got a Starbucks gift card for our neighbor downstairs because we were making so much noise last night, and I felt so bad like building furniture and stuff. So I'm just gonna give him a Starbucks gift card. Make my way down to the pool. I just got the guest Wi-Fi password for the apartment, so hopefully I can get the Wi-Fi working out by the pool and finish uploading my YouTube videos. But yeah, first pool day, I'm so excited. Oh no, I'm wearing this cute little cover-up from Amazon, I'll link it down below, and then just like this black plain bikini. I think this is from Target, I don't even know, I got it so long ago. But yeah, let's go check out the pool. 